I hit like for uh, supporting the Whitetail Diary page and also just for everybody out there hunting. Everybody likes so much as much as me. Hoping, it, it said win a hunt, hoping um, I knew it wasn't going to be no chance of me winning. I guess the Lord said, hey, this guy, get him to hunt there. And, uh, and I won, man. I just can't believe it. After the morning hunt, Wade and Gates spent some time sighting in the Thompson Center rifle that Gates will be using and making sure he was comfortable before they head back out to the food plot for the afternoon. You know, as you get back and you're kind of hanging around the camp and you're doing a variety of things and watching a little football and cooking and playing and everything, my mind is always thinking about what's the next step. What are these deer doing? Where are they going to go? Where are we going to go for our next hunt? But I had pretty much pot committed at least this first full day. We were going to hunt that food plot and, and food plot hunting is generally better in the afternoon and I thought, man, this will be be really good, but there was one thing about this day that really had me worried. It was no clouds, and a, a setting sun in this particular setup really is tough. I mean, the sun is gonna light us up like spotlights. Come on, big boy. Show up out there. It was a tough set. The light was tough, the deer were tough, and for whatever reason that evening, the deer around us were blowing. You know, they were just in one of those nervous Nelly moods and they'd come out and they'd look at us and they'd look at the bush and then they'd look over here and the next thing you know, they'd all blow and they'd be gone. And at the end of the first day, the plans that I had in my mind, they just simply didn't come together. But you couldn't tell that Gates was disappointed at all because he was still grinning and having a blast and he saw a lot of deer. Some deer had even got him pretty excited, but I just felt like you know, conditions could get better and maybe we could find some bigger deer than what we'd passed. 